Good morning, everybody. I got Princess Hannah here. Harley's in the other room. She's in the foyer. She's been kind of doing her own thing, but she's a happy girl. So this is Jesus Always. Um, and I love it because they have a, a little opening line, opening like uh, for, the, for the month of February. So, behold, God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. For the Lord God is my strength and song, and he has become my salvation. Oh boy, you have no idea. Isaiah 12, verse 2. That was beautiful. Was that beautiful? Is that beautiful? What do you think? Oh, thank you for the kiss. Thank you for my kisses. Such a good girl. Okay, let's read the devotion. Want to help, Mama? Want to help me? You want to help Mama read the devotion? <laughs> okay, let's get at it. Let's get our Bible reading in. Don't shake your head. Got to bake some Jesus into this room because this is the room that's, this is the bedroom that's close to the tool next door. So we need more Jesus. He's been quiet, but we need more Jesus in this room. I just feel it. So let's bake some in here. So I decided to start reading them in this room. That's why there's a change of scenery. I am the living one who sees you. I am more fully gloriously alive than you can imagine. Someday you will see my face to face in all my glory. And you will be awestruck. Now, though you see through a glass darkly, your view of me is obscured by your fallen condition nonetheless. I see you with perfect clarity. Oh boy. <laughs> see right through him? Come here, what are you doing over there? She put her butt to me, a goofball. I know everything about you, including your most secret thoughts and feelings. I understand how broken and weak you are. I remember that you are dust. Yet I choose to love you with everlasting love. The gift of my love was indescribably costly. I endured unspeakable suffering to save you from an eternity of agony. I became sin for you so that in me you might become the righteousness of God. Ponder this wondrous truth. My righteousness is now yours. This gift is of an infinite value, has been yours ever since you trusted me as the God-man who saved you from your sins. Rejoice that the living one who sees you perfectly is the Savior who loves you always. So she called the name of the Lord who spoke to her. You are a God of seeing, for she said, Have I not, even here in the wilderness, looked upon him who sees me and lived? Or have I here also seen the future purposes or designs of him who sees me? Therefore the well was called Birlaroi, Bir, something like that, a well to the living one who sees me. It is between Kadesh and Barad, Genesis 16, verses 13 through 14. For now we see through a glass darkly, but then face to face now I know in part, but then shall I know, even as I also I am known. 1 Corinthians 13, verse 12. For he knows how we are formed. He remembers that we are dust. Psalm 103, verse 14. God made him who had no sin to be sins for us, so that in him we might become the righteousness of God. 2 Corinthians 5, verse 21. Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Spread love and kindness and his word wherever you go today. Lord knows this world has had a bad care cut long enough, don't you think? And it's time we start doing it the way he would. So, this distant, long distance trip we're going on is going to be all about Jesus, too. Well, in the convention states, too, because I got to get more people to sign the convention. So, you know, you know me, I got a gift gab. Yeah, I'll talk to anybody, no matter what. So, fearless, ferocious, and got two Rottweilers.
ready, willing, and able to protect and serve. Truly, what a blessing. What a gift. What a path. This is a lot more fun than the hell I went through during tax season, to be perfectly honest. So, anyway, sorry. Have a great day. Love you.